so to start off this get ready with me i'm just going to go in with some tarte ready set radiant and spray that all over and basically prep my skin and add moisture after that i'm going to use the tarte shape tape in the shade light neutral and i'm just going to get underneath my eyes and i want to do my eyelids as well after that i'm going to go in with a damp beauty blender and blend everything out Do not mind my powder pan, but I'm going to go in with the Never Touch Up Color Correcting Powder. The shade is invisible and I'm going to use my damp beauty blender just to go in and set everything. <music> So I got asked on Instagram when I posted a FAQ on All Things Beauty, um, what is your favorite makeup product to use on your eyebrows? Recently, I have been using the Benefit Boof Proof Pencil in the number three. And on top of that, I've been using the Anastasia Tinted Brow Gel and the shade is Brunette. To start off my eyes, I'm going to go in with the Dose of Colors Friendcation Palette. And the first shade I'm going to start using is Necessary, and I'm only going to be using this inside of my crease. that I have applied the snow flush all over my lid I'm gonna go back in with the shade necessary and just make sure everything blends together so I'm just gonna go back in with my concealer brush and make sure everything looks shaped and then I'm gonna go into my waterline with the Urban Decay 24 7 glide on eyeliner pencil and the shade is gonna be space dust now I'm going to go in with the It's My Ray Ray palette by BH Cosmetics and I'm going to be using the shade Friday just to line underneath my eyes. To finish off my eyes, I'm going to use the Colossal Volume Mascara by Maybelline and I'm going to apply it to my top and bottom lashes. I'm going to be using the Bare Minerals Original Formula and my shade is Medium Beige. I'm going to go back into the It's My Ray Ray palette by BH Cosmetics and use the shade Mocha to contour my cheeks, my nose, and my forehead. same palette I'm gonna go into the shade sunset and use that as my blush
Using a fan brush, I'm going to go back into the MAC Snow Flush Highlighter. Use that on my cheekbones, my temples, my nose, and my cupid's bow. Now I'm going to use the Urban Decay Razor Sharp Eyeliner in the shade Space Cowboy and cut my crease with it. I'm going to use the NYX Lip Pencil in the shade Natural. To fill in my lips, I'm going to use the Kylie Liquid Lipstick in the shade Candy K. Watching this right now, you're probably gonna laugh because I eat these all the time. All the time. So the first question that I got asked was. Um, what do I use in my curly hair? And I use the Diva Curl Believe In. It is the Miracle Curl Plumper. Um, all of the products actually that I'm going to be using have moisture in them because when it gets colder out, I'm, my skin is dry, my hair is dry, and it's just not the one. But this is really good for adding moisture and shine and to bring out your natural curls. And I've been liking it really a lot so far because it doesn't feel like it's crunchy in my hair it doesn't feel like it really does not feel like there's any product in my hair at all um the next thing i'm going to use i actually got asked um what is oh give me one sec give me one sec it says here in my documents what do i use to prep my face um i actually use two different things so what i start off with is the ready set radiant by tarte um, it's a two-in-one hydrating mist um, and it's lightweight as well so I like using it because it makes my skin feel super dewy and it kind of feels a little sticky when you first spray it on but I like it a lot because it I want to feel like my makeup is being held in place and use the <coughs> excuse me prime and it's the fix plus in gold light this has been the bomb so far literally the bomb like it has little gold flecks in it and i feel like it just adds a little bit more to your foundation your powder whatever you're using so that's all i've been using so far anyways so yeah that's what what's going on and we're just going to talk about a life update as well so what's been going on i actually just got my first tattoo yeah let's talk about that I got this about a month ago. I follow at your tat lady on Instagram. Um, I'm gonna put her at name below so that you guys can follow her. She does amazing tattoos. Our whole service was. Um. What else has been going on? Oh, so I got a full time chair at Stella Luca Salon in Winter Park Village. If you guys haven't seen it on my Instagram already, and if you're in the Orlando area and need your hair, dude, come see a girl. Come see me. Follow me on Instagram at Ritz Nicole. Check out my work and let me know. You know, DM me. DM your girl. Let me know what's coming up. I think that's pretty much it besides living my best life.
Okay, bye. Okay, guys, to finish up my hair routine, I'm going to show you guys what I'm going to use. 